Christ is all about celebrating diversity and celebrating how through diversity we can be one. And that is Stony Brook to its core. What does character before career mean? It's to pursue beauty and truth and goodness and justice and all of those values that we embrace. Dr. Gabriel, he prayed for every student by name every day. He was a very bright fellow. He was a great pianist. He used to play duets with Albert Einstein in Princeton. I just don't think we even understand the depth of that covering and blessing that comes from a life of prayer. His vision was that you mold people here and send them out into the world. How do you maintain your identity as Stony Brook, but at the same time make room for these other cultural realities that come into your place? Having girls come to the Stony Brook School was a big change. <laughs> well, the whole student body thought it was a good idea, except the seventh grade. My son was in the seventh grade at the time. They voted no, we didn't even want girls in the school. They changed their mind later. <laughs> we don't have to be limited by our space here or even proximity in New York. This could be global. The COVID problem what, that forced us to go online showed the amazing versatility of the faculty. That, I think, laid the foundation for the Gravitas program. We've always tried to bring in kids who need scholarships. This will be on a whole new level <laughs> of being able to do that and reach kids who never could travel here, which is absolutely thrilling. The best kinds of schools, in my view, are somewhat future tellers. They're thinking about not just the world as it is and what kids need at this moment, but they're also doing their best to look into the future and say, you know what, this is the way in which the world is going and we've got to be sure that we're equipping kids for that world and not the world that's in an era and gone by. What's next? You need to keep preparing them to begin asking the big questions because it's not what it was, it's what it's going to be. Showing a vision a vision for the school that we're expanding, that there's tremendous need, not only here in Stony Brook, Long Island, but all across the world. In human parlance, 100 years, well, gee, that seems like we're pretty old. But when you look at the scope of history and the scope of time, we're really just getting started. The first chapter's been written, and we will see how God writes the rest of our story.